berets. <laughs> women with berets. <laughs> I didn't think I'd see so many women wearing berets. Have you seen? Yeah, one? yeah. Today? Yeah. <laughs> I was surprised. It's like, oh, they, there's a lot of girls. They actually wear the berets. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> First time in Paris. Uh, oh, it reminded me of New York City, actually. <laughs> Unless I was looking up. If I was, like, it's very familiar as far as just people around me and everything like that. But then looking up, I felt like I was in a uh, Barry Lyndon movie or something. <laughs> it felt uh, almost unreal, just the, the old buildings that you, you know, that I'm only used to seeing and paintings and old films, you know. So that was pretty amazing. Just think of old movies. I just think of movies because I'm such a big movie fan and I watch a lot of foreign movies. So it just immediately reminds me of movies. I was talking about Jacques Tati's movies. and <laughs> um, I hate to say Amelie because I know that's really popular, but the woman at the hotel <laughs> seemed like a caricature. <laughs> I was like thinking, no, this, this is like, she's kind of like a cartoon character. This is probably not a typical. Parisian woman. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Just trying to as accurately as possible draw the buildings over there. Dish on top. <laughs> See, it's always strange when I see a uh, satellite dish or something. Because <laughs> I feel like I'm not in the contemporary culture, but I... I'm going to throw the dish in. But I was looking at all these really amazing, breathtaking buildings uh, and uh, but then the other thing is uh, just looking at uh, signs any sign on any shop is amazing to me <laughs> hand painted or hand drawn or, or three-dimensional uh, signs I love comics everything comics related is exciting to me but especially France because I, I read a lot of French comic books so I was in a store and I wanted to buy up every book that I saw even though I can't read it because it's like in the US we don't get everything that's that's published here so And did you draw something uh, this morning? No, no, it was it was too cold. <laughs> Not enough time. I was just trying to see as much of it as I could. Lots of windows. <laughs> I like drawing buildings. Uh, it's funny. Um, I even uh, most people feel like really um, at ease or relaxing in a park, but I actually like to be in a downtown city uh, when there's nobody around, just buildings, quiet buildings above me to walk around. I love that. I don't know why it's. Uh, It's a tranquil, that's a tranquil feeling for me, to just be around these giant buildings. And what did so, you yeah. want to do the next time in Paris? See the Eiffel Tower, I don't think I'm going to see that. I should see that. I know it's like <laughs> typical tourist, but uh, I'm sure it must be amazing. Maybe I'll see it tonight. But I would also love to, of course, like see the museums. And some more bookstores. Bookstores are really amazing too. <laughs> you finished? Yes. <laughs> I can't, my hands are getting hurt. <laughs> oh, 
Perfect. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My hands are... <laughs> 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 <laughs>